Where's Rian? Boo. Where's Rian? Good morning. Say good morning. Oh, we need to cut your fingernails today. That is on our agenda. We've got to cut your fingernails. Her fingernails are so long, and Ethan, I've been saying for like past week, they need to be cut. Um, but we, it is about 9.30, and we're just sitting around doing a whole lot of nothing. I have felt so good this morning. I the, hey, hey, little girl. <laughs> I don't know if the medicine is kind of lingering around from yesterday, but I haven't had to take any today, and I slept really good last night, and so thankful for that. But I even slept in my makeup last night, as you can tell, which is terrible for me, but... I'm about to go jump in the shower and get ready for the day, but I had to show you Rian's cuteness this morning with her peekaboo. Boo! Where's Rian? Where's Rian? Boo! All right, let's walk outside. Go outside. Let's go. This sun is cute. We're gonna go play outside for just a little bit. It's so nice out here again. It's so nice. You got sprinkles. Some play sprinkles in your hand. Delaney has been obsessed. She was playing with these rocks and filling bowls up and cups up and all kinds of stuff. She loves it. Yeah. Why do you like those rocks so much? Is it fun filling everything up? Yeah. She's been finding stuff in her playroom that she could fill up with. All right, Rand, let's go find this bug. Yesterday, Delaney found a caterpillar. And she was like obsessed with this thing, so she wanted to come check on it. It's still up here. And it looks, I don't think it's alive anymore. It's not moving at least. Maybe it's asleep. It's been in the same spot. You think it's asleep? I'm not sure. It's not moving. You want me to try to touch it? Nope. It's not alive anymore. How? Say no more bug. No more bugs. I bet it gets so hot right there in the sun that the sun probably burnt it up. I don't know. I'm not sure because this side, this this right here gets really hot. Me, Me you want to go get yours? Let's go get yours. All right, Ren, Ren's got her four wheeler out today. Can you get on it? Get on there. Let's see. Get your leg over. Let me help you. There you go. Good job. You can go for a walk. You can go walk. Yeah. <laughs> Did you drop your sprinkles? There's your sprinkles. Especially these pink ones. They're like a pink peachy color. They are all so cool. Let's, let's get them. What you gonna do with them? I'm you gonna, gonna go hunt for more? I'm gonna put them on the other side. Oh, on the other side of your bike. Gotcha. You want a snack? Can you give me the bowl? What kind of snack do y'all want? Y'all want a snack? Alright, let's wash them. I haven't washed the blueberries yet. Y'all want some blueberries for a snack? Yeah. I gotta wash them. Let me see them. I'll wash them. <laughs> Rian actually loves blueberries now. In fact, she, before too long ago, if I would try blueberries with her, she would not touch them. She'd put it in her mouth and spit it right back out and not touch another one. So that goes to show you, the pediatrician has said, if she don't like something, keep giving it to her. Eventually she might like it. And that's so true with so many things for her. She was not a fruit fan at all, like hardly any fruits. And now pretty much every fruit that I give her, she'll eat. So, I'm so thankful for that. Delaney was a pretty healthy eater when she was Ren's age. And um, there for a while, I was like, this child does not want to eat anything healthy. So I'm thankful she likes blueberries and bananas and oranges and grapes and all the fruits now. I have a sleepy baby girl. Are you so tired? Look, you want your juice? There you go. You're so tired. It feels so nice. We're back out here. I just got 
myself halfway ready. Um, put some makeup on. But I have filmed this twice, what I wanted to say. And both of them I got done filming. And I was like, I didn't say exactly like everything that I wanted to say or how I wanted to say it. The first time I filmed it, it came off really harsh. And so I knew I didn't want to leave that in. The second time, I feel like I didn't say exactly what I wanted to say. So here I am again. I'm it a third time. But I've been reading through some of the comments on today's video. Actually, it'll be yes yesterday's video for you guys when you see this. And I'm getting a few comments most comments are the sweetest you guys like i seriously have some really supportive subscribers that leave really sweet comments but there is a few that um want to leave say negative things and some of them are not trying i don't think they're trying to be super negative but i just and some basically what a few people are saying is that i talk about my pregnancy too much and my vlogs have changed and they don't like me talking about the pregnancy so much where is the family vlogs at and i guess what i want to first of all say to that is that i'm pregnant i'm pregnant and so it's a big part of our lives right now and it's a part of our lives that Ethan and I both are just, and Delaney, like our whole family, is just so excited about. And it's something that we feel excited to talk about a lot. And I do, I mean, it's something that I plan on talking about daily. Whether some people may like it or not. The thing about it is, is this is my channel. I'm watching, baby. Yay! She's riding her bike on the driveway. Delaney and I are out here. Ren's taking a nap. Go, Laney, go. But this is my channel, and for the most part, I get a lot of comments from people saying that they love the updates and all that. But the thing is, this is my channel. I choose what to put out there. I choose what to talk about daily. Do I talk about the pregnancy a lot? Yes, I do. And it's still new to us. We found out... 15 days ago that we were pregnant and it's still new to us and it's something that's just so excited for us so exciting for us and if you don't like it the only thing that i can say is if you're not enjoying my vlogs anymore go find somebody that you'll enjoy i mean it's not gonna hurt my feelings at all if you do not enjoy my vlogs anymore because when it comes down to it it's my channel and i'm gonna put out there what i want to put out there whether a few of you may like it or not like i said go find another channel this somebody's not pregnant or somebody that if they are maybe they don't talk about it as much as i do but i enjoy talking about it and just moving forward for those of you who might want to leave a comment and say things like that and moving forward just fyi i'm gonna talk about it daily and so for those of you who leave those comments just go ahead and move on don't leave me comments like that anymore it, just go take your time to somebody else's channel who you enjoy I, I i guess i just don't understand why take the time to leave a comment and watch a video somebody's channel that you're just not enjoying anymore just take your eyes to another channel i guess is what i'm trying to say so i just wanted to just put that out there for the next seven months my channel is going to be a lot of pregnancy stuff and if you guys don't like that, the only thing I can say is go ahead and hit and subscribe. It's not going to bother me. And go find another channel. So, those of you who do support me and love my updates, thank you so much. Those of you who who have put really nice comments and um, thoughtful comments on today's vlog, thank y'all so much. And I realize um, as my channel grows, there will be a lot of more people with strong opinions different opinions than other people have than what i have and i guess there's been other youtubers that i watched and i enjoyed watching them and um their content may have changed or their lives may have changed and i just wasn't relatable to them anymore or i didn't enjoy watching their content anymore instead of commenting and telling them that and telling them how um i'm not enjoying what they're putting out now instead of doing that 
I just left it alone. I unsubscribed and I left because when it comes down to it, that is their channel and they choose what they put on their channel. And no matter my opinion on it, I'm not going to tell them my opinion on it because it's their channel and they work hard on their channel. They work hard on putting videos out every day or however often. And that is their business on what they want to put out there. And so whenever I watch a YouTuber and I just don't relate to them anymore or don't enjoy their videos, I just leave it. I don't comment telling them that. So I guess that I just don't understand why people feel the need to comment and tell me I miss y'all vlogs. I don't like your pregnancy vlogs, blah, blah, blah. Because when it comes down to it, for the next seven months, I'm going to be pregnant and I'm going to vlog about it every single day. So I guess I just wanted to put that out there. I don't feel the need to explain myself about everything, but I just wanted to put it out there that, hey, for the next seven months, you're going to see a lot of these updates just forewarning you if you don't enjoy that. I have to share something really cute. Anytime Ethan and I are in the bathroom getting ready, Rian thinks she has to be in here every time and she'll like stand here and watch us. So when Ethan came in here, Ethan says she does it every time. She does it with me too, but she'll, Ethan will put the step stool over there. She will go pick the step stool up and put it right here so she can look over the sink and watch what we're doing. It's so cute. Are you smart? Do you get that step stool every single time? You got lotion? All right, Miss Diva in diapers is ready. Are you ready to go? With her juice, her dinosaurs. Daddy and Lainey are in here playing heads or tails. <laughs> I, won, I won three points. Three points. Daddy won three points. Oh, y'all are tied. Oh. Now and, then, and then I'm going to be four points. And Daddy's going <laughs> to be are five hyper. points. <laughs> Somebody's excited. Yeah. Ethan and I are actually about to go out on a little date night. So, how me pick out a necklace to wear with my dress. Let's see, something to go with my old navy gray dress. Something comfy today. Um, normally I wear this one, the blue tassel. Maybe. Don't get dressed in front of the camera, dude. I'm waiting for you. To <laughs> okay. All right, I chose this one i feel like it kind of blends into the dress but it'll work <laughs> i felt pretty good today like probably my best day like i felt pretty normal so i was able to get house kind of clean today cleaned up a little bit vacuumed kind of clean the kitchen up a little bit so now i'm excited to go on date night and go out to dinner it's always exciting we haven't been out on date night in a while a couple weeks three probably three or four weeks so I'm excited to go on date night. All right, the biggest question of the night is, what are we gonna eat? The biggest thing we can never agree over is what are we gonna eat tonight? What do you think? What are you feeling tonight? I'm hungry. I'm pretty hungry. Um, I don't know either. I don't know what sounds good. I'll have to think about that one. I feel like I might could eat some meat. Some, 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 I don't know, maybe not. I have to think about it. Pasta? Oh, I might could eat some pasta. We haven't been to Olive Garden in a long time. I don't know. I have to think about it. We came to Olive Garden. We got some fettuccine alfredo. Ethan got the tour of Italy. <laughs> Ethan and I, was funny, we used to come here all the time. We used to share that tour of Italy, and Ethan's like, times have changed. And he pointed to his belly. <laughs> Um, something else. It's funny when I walked in, Ethan was parking the car, and the lady that was gonna sit me said, "Oh, are you waiting on your mom?" Like I was like really young, <laughs> so, um, so she thought I was pretty old. I was like, "No, I'm waiting on my husband." Delaney's been talking about a new bike for Christmas. And how cute is this? Do you like that? Yeah, it really I is love nice. It. It's just something different besides princesses or. And it's got a cute little basket, like a little flower petal. Mm -hmm. I think this is a size she needs, a size up from what she's got, it's 16 inch. But how cute is that? Yeah, I like it. This, if we get her one for Christmas, we'll have to come back here. I love this. 
This is something that'll grow with her too. I love it. Yeah, it's so a, cute. I love all the flowers. That's a stuff. schwinn. That's a good bike. Yeah, this is so cute. We went to Target and I grabbed some. If I can get them out. Um, I was looking at the maternity leg, not leggings. Um, these are jeggings, so they look like jeans, but they're really like a legging feel. Um, but they got the band. I just think the band is so comfortable, and um, they're just like um, jeans. I figured they last me like all throughout the fall and winter time. So I went and grabbed those just because they're just comfortable and. Um, I'm not really buying a ton of stuff right now, but let me know what are you guys' favorite places to shop for maternity stuff. I want to budget. Like, I don't want to spend a ton of money on maternity clothes, but I know we have a motherhood in this town. It's at the mall, um, but we're not going to go there and look today. Uh, but let me know. I know um, Old Navy is supposed to have cute stuff. Um, Old Navy, I don't think the stores around here has maternity i'd have to order online i hate ordering some stuff online just because of the size of the stuff but anyways let me know what you guys favorite places are terrible lighting i know but we got both the girls a surprise at target and delaney's dying to have hers now so here you go what is that is that your favorite yeah delaney is obsessed with the vampirina show vampirina and fancy what is it? What? Is it Vampirina in her backpack? Yeah. yeah. What did Rian got? Rian has a little mini mouse toy, but I'm going to wait till we get home to give her hers. She can't see her. Here, I'll let you hold it. Here's your mini mouse. What is that? Yeah, it was between that and a fancy fancy doll. There. Just that. That's what we got you and Rian. What like? about her friends? Who? Poppy and Bridget. Oh, well maybe next time we go we could get those. That's, that's what that one came with. Do you like it? Is that cool? Is that your Thank favorite you, show? Mama. You're welcome. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you, Daddy. You're welcome. <laughs> Let me see, Laney. Vampirina. We'll have to get some scissors or something and take that part off right there. <gasps> Daddy found it. You want your mini? Look what he's got. He got you a mini mouse. Look at that. What is that? We got a mini mouse. You want to see her mini mouse? We got her little mini mouse. We thought she might like that. <gasps> Look. I think it like rolls or something. You want to roll a mini? Uh -huh. All right. We are going to let these girls see their toys. And we're going to get them to bed. And I'm ready for bed myself. So, hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Subscribe if you're new. And we will see you guys tomorrow. Say bye.